hello. Oh, it looks so good. It looks so good. It looks so good. Yeah. Cute. <laughs> Don't know who I was expecting, but. <laughs> oh, that's a little bit What do you think? Yeah. Cute. Nice. Very but. different. Eshna, it has been an extraordinary journey to reach this point and it's been an honour to witness your personal growth all whilst you put the needs of your family and friends before your own. I promise that you will always accomplish your dreams because I will chase them harder than anyone else. Life itself is very short so I vow to cherish our moments together, work towards resolutions and build a beautiful life together. I promise to never leave dishes in the sink and to remove all the spiders from our future home. <laughs> I promise to share food, music, laughter and Labradors and I'm so lucky that our paths cross more than once and each new day brings an opportunity to nurture our love. From this day on, you are my forever companion and I cannot wait to start the next chapter of our life together. When I was younger, I always tried to imagine who I'd end up sharing my life with. I remember reading something online that said that most people meet their soulmate by 21. I thought that was a lie once I was actually 21, but little did I know that I had met my future husband across the table in tutoring when I was 16. You came into my life again when I least expected it, and yet it was exactly at the right time. From then on, you intrigued me, charmed me, challenged me, and six years later, I'm still laughing and finding myself falling more in love with you as each day passes. You have made me the person I am today, and I'm so excited for a new adventure ahead. As we go forward, I promise to nurture your dreams and passions. I promise to persevere when life throws its challenges and stand by your side. I promise to continue to have fun and laugh with you and sit through your three-hour critically acclaimed movies. <laughs> Most of all, I promise to show you each and every day how lucky I am to have you in my life. Aishna, I want to you know, thank you for looking after my brother, now and forever. I think you compliment Kumi in many ways. Uh, you guys have a lot of shared passions, obviously. I think my only concern is that under your watch, Kumi somehow transitioned to become a vegan. Um, but look, I think that's your problem now. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you guys both a, a lifetime of happiness and success. And I look forward to the free babysitting and dental checks when I'm back. Have you seen a more aesthetic, smart, accomplished and successful couple? Ash has a common phrase. Dude, can you believe it? 
Two houses, two lads, four rings later. I do believe. Humi Nesh, your friends first, partners, classmates, colleagues, and now husband and wife. Your bond is like fourth generation on Dentine. It's gold standard. For a man who's clearly lost the plot, I guess it's great for you that you'll never actually do anything because you have an allergy to actually making decisions. I always wondered if Esh ever proposed to you, would you have said, no, nah, it's up to you, I don't mind. <laughs> I still remember when Kumi first told me about Ash. We were sitting down one day and I remember asking him, Hey bro, how are the girls? <laughs> and now he turns to me and he says, Yeah, so I'm dating someone. And he looked so happy. Had this little glint in his eye. And now in the back of my mind, I'm like, Who's this girl dating my little Kumi? And I finally got to meet you, Ash, and I realized how perfect you are for each other. You really do bring out the best in, and it's been an absolute pleasure getting to know you. I see how patient you are with him, and your biggest feat to date has been the change that I've seen in Kumi, from this shy, nose-rubbing little boy into the strong, confident man that sits next to you now. You really do complete him.